I would like to welcome you to what is clearly enough a Minecraft video. And it is more specifically within a mod pack that is mostly focused on the Black Clover mod, but has many interesting additions. And uh, yeah, well, absolutely honestly, today I have a couple of very simple goals. I need to acquire a lot of funding. And I also plan on taking castles, destroying monsters, a lot of different ideas, sadly enough I don't have a super specific goal, but I do have main goals on which I can work in general. As I said, gathering funding, more specifically gold, which then I can turn into crowns, which then I can turn into subordinates. Like, uh, yeah, I'm not even gonna say the names. Also, also, I forgot what else I wanted to say. Very interesting question, let's hope I remember. Uh, anyhow, let's get to home four. Oh, oh, this was the plan of the video which I had. Yeah, 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 yeah. So you see, home four uh, is this pyramid, which honestly is right next to a castle. And obviously, if I take over castles, so oh, and there is may maybe that's gonna be home four. So yeah, today I'm gonna take down a pharaoh, maybe take down that giant sand castle as well. Oh, it's open for me. Hmm. Uh. Guys, you know you stand absolutely zero chance against me, right? Okay, these are the buttons. So yeah, I can fly and I can uh, do arrows of judgment. And uh, I also have a giant light sword. If I can find it in my... I'm scrolling for everything. Ah, there is my giant light sword. And yeah. I'm pretty powerful. Oh, they drop gold nuggets. Ooh. Oh, here's the pharaoh. Uh, hello there, Pharaoh. How much damage do you do? Ooh, you actually blind me and do half a heart. You also do swollenness, but obviously you know, that does not matter to me. Uh, now let's put my... I believe, yeah. Now I have my mana shield and mana boosting fists. And I do... Oh, I didn't do that much damage. Yeah. But obviously you know, I am taking no damage. Oh, wait. It's, is it taking damage from hitting me? Yeah, I think it is actually taking damage from hitting me. The mummies can't even damage me though. That's impressive. However, I will definitely keep this spawner because obviously of golden nuggets. That's kind of the most important resource in this mod pack. I can get a lot of subordinates with it. And uh, yeah, let's just do this one. 44 damage. Ew. Wow, these guys are rather defensive. I'm impressed. Ooh. I got a golden scarab, and this scarab is trying to eat me, but obviously enough it cannot, it literally isn't strong enough to break from my defense. Okay. Well, that went well. Maybe I can get all the items that it has at a later date, after all I just took down the boss and the golden scarab is the only thing I got from taking down the pharaoh. Obviously enough though I can look in, I need to install just enough items or any mod that allows me to know crafting recipes because yeah, I'm not looking at that. But anyhow, I, I guess I just take down over that area? Sure, it's right over there. Absolutely honestly, I didn't even notice it whenever I was exploring, which is impressive. Very difficult to ignore such a thing. But yeah, light magic overpowered got against, I assume, another decently weak knights. Oh! Oh, I'm not gonna be fighting knights, I'll be fighting just for your monsters. Alright, let's just throw this castle, I guess, from the top to bottom. Obviously, you know, the most valuable items should be at the top. Oh, is it because it's daytime, they don't even spawn right now? Ooh, gold. Shocker? Okay, that is useful. Wait, are you serious? Am I seriously gonna be able to take down this whole castle without even ever needing to fight? I really want to collect all the materials, but honestly, they don't matter. They really don't. The only thing that really matters is gold. <laughs> uh, yeah. And if you're wondering why these guys are actually ignoring me, well, in all likelihood they're ignoring me because of a magical item I have. And this is an ancient heart. Okay, it seems golden, it might be useful. Did I explain why the zombies are actually ignoring me? I don't know. But yeah, it has to do with an item I haven't. Wow, yeah, no interesting items. Well, since there are no interesting items and I care about nothing else here, and there we go! Now let's just continue flying on, maybe I'll find something interesting and I'll immediately find something interesting. Mana necklace! Boxer homunculi DNA. Oh, it seems like this is some dark magic stuff. 
alchemist librarian, right? That's your name? Maybe? That's his name? Is it his name? I don't know. But, uh... This is an interesting house you have, and it's relatively close to my uh, waystone. And you know what? I actually like this little house. So I'm just gonna... Wait. Wait. Okay. I'm gonna break the other waystone, which says home 4. And I'm gonna make this my home. If I can just push this guy into the thing. I can't believe that this is the most difficult part of this video, but okay. Why can't I... So, I have spells that allow me to literally take down armies, but I can't push a villager. Ah, thank you. <sighs> that was way more difficult than it ever needed to be. What do we have at the top? We have... A painting. We have multiple paintings. Um... Ooh! I like the art. Uh, right, I've probably installed a mod. Oh, maybe it's, it's the texture pack. It's probably the texture pack. Home 4. It is next to four, well, it is next to two giant castles, and there's always, you know, this alchemist guy which is gonna teach me other types of magic. Which, by the way, this mod has many other uh, magical mods, because obviously you know, the Black Clover mod, I believe, has only four magical types, and the only mod that I'm aware of that exists within this Black Clover mod is passive. Although, technically, I've never tried to fight it, so I can try to do that. Yeah, <laughs> absolutely destroyed. Oh! Oh, maybe I'll take down on these guys. Yeah, there's a small army here. Might as well. Ah, <laughs> uh, yeah. So cute of them. To actually think that they can do anything against me. Yeah. I haven't... I'm not even halfway going all out, but yeah. Half? Half going all out? Sure. Right, punch you out. And oh, it seems like they were actually oh they were fighting the mobs. How very unfortunate for them. But yeah, that's about that. And hey, might as well do this tower as well since it's right over here. Oh, oh, talking about gold and more resources. Well, that was fun, I guess. And oh, enchanted scrolls. Okay, 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 okay. That's cool. That's cool. That's cool. Uh, oh, these things are so annoying. No, 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 no. Let's not end the video with annoying creatures. Oh, oh look at how many of them. Okay, I'm taking this. Uh, t I've taken over. There we go. I can always break the spawners, no issue. But, uh, okay. Auto aim abilities, please. Nope. Just, okay. How? Okay, I c it's unbelievable. Oh, I hate Vex. I actually despise them. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You know what? You know what? Uh, I still don't know the buttons, but you know what? Yeah. Uh-huh. And there we go. Everything I care about taken and uh, we're done. So, I guess for the next one I probably will have a better plan than just going around the area that they wanted to take over. I was really expecting quite more of a challenge from the Pharaoh, if you gotta be honest. Hope you had fun. And bye.